Well, how do there, John? So, yesterday I did some testing, and it looked fantastic while I was actually playing the game. But as I was running around the Nexus, I noticed all this pixely artifacting, which I'm just not seeing on my PC screen. Anyway, a few people hit me up with a few DMs, and they told me about a certain setting that I should perhaps turn off. So, although that I've got this lovely AMD sort of graphics card, they told me what I needed to turn off was this sort of stuff. The actual enhanced stuff, you know? So anyway, I'm going to turn that off and leave that off. Aha, it's this, the anti-aliasing as well. It's the anti-aliasing that they told me to turn off, the FSR 20 or 2.0. Turn that off. The Gatto, they didn't quite say anything about that. Huh. Well, I'll turn that back on, I think. Hi. Ultra. All right. We'll go with that then. All right, let's, let's see how that does. All right, so I've turned off the FSR, and we're going to see if that's any better. You know what? I've got the I've still got the footage from yesterday, so I put that straight after this, so people can see the difference between the smooth. two. I've turned off anti-aliasing. Seems extremely sharp, but is it too sharp? I mean, do I need some anti-aliasing? I don't know. I mean, I'll show you my net. Well, I'll show you my graphic settings. So I've got it here. So I've got it on that resolution. Borderless, I've got it on ultra on everything. I've turned on this super fidelity because it seems to be boosting the graphics card. And I turned off the my motion blur. I might just put on, you know, like 40 or something. I'm not a fan of motion blur, so there you go. You know, probably do the trick, wouldn't it? Not that you can really notice it at all, but there we go. Done. I'm not seeing any other people inside the Nexus, but then I am on PC Experimental. Because although that some people will buy the graphics card just for that feature, it seems to be that, for whatever reason, on the actual rendering or buffering, I don't know, because it looks great on screen. So anyway, I'm just going to run around here a bit so we can do a proper comparison. But I'm hoping this looks pretty darn awesome now, you know? Uh, let's turn that gatto off as well. So let's just go into here. Let's, let's see if that makes any difference then. Diddly diddly dee. And then turn that off. All right, so I've, I've pretty much got nothing on now. <laughs> Get apply. Okay. You know what? I'm also going to turn the motion blur right off. I'm not a fan of motion blur anyway. I did have it off the other day, but um, I put it back up to 40 because I wondered whether that might help with the um, the pixeling or whatever. But you know what? I think just leave it standard. Don't have the graphics card or anything to try and help with the way it should look. Just let the graphics card do what the graphics card should do. I mean, let's face it, the graphics card was like freaking god knows how much money for my bloody computer wasn't it right then let's just jump out of here lovely jobs chicka pow pow chicka boom boom oh and somebody actually asked me what my pc spec is so you know what let's just quit out to desktop and uh, i'll bring it up for you here you go because to be fair I i'm not i'm not overly clued up on exactly what my laptop can and can't do where's my keyboard there it is on the floor because i've got no desk space <laughs> yeah here we go let's just go into this info chicka pow pow chicka boom boom and um well, i might have to make this bigger for you somehow by zooming in i'll zoom in and then i'll make it pan down slowly for you okay so what i'm reading here it's an amd ryzen 9 7 9, x 3d 12 core processor running at 440.01 megahertz i don't know why they couldn't just rounded that down or up you know what i'm saying uh, 12 cores, 24 logic processor. Yeah, that, it, that sounds lovely, doesn't it? And it's running on a Mag B650 Tomahawk Wi Fi motherboard. So uh, by MicroStar, yeah, or MSI as people like to call it. Yeah, so that's that's pretty much my computer, I guess. Oh, oh how much RAM has it got in there? 
I think it's got yeah 64 gigabytes of RAM. Yeah, pretty nice. And that's 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 the machine. That's it. Cool, yeah. Right, and I spent some time making a new background for my PC. That's actually my wallpaper on my PC there. So right over on the far sort of side of the screen, just above my head here, that is Rockwell inside of the Philippines. And I thought that goes with the Vlogs logo, which is kind of behind me right now. Captain Steve Vlogs. Yeah, and then in the middle, Captain Steve Plays, which I play a lot on No Man's Sky. I'm hoping to play other games now, like maybe Star Citizen and Starfield with mods on perhaps the Star Wars ones. I think that could be quite fun. Um, but yeah, a few other PC sort of titles perhaps. And then over on the far side over there, Captain Steve talks. So I'll talk a bit about UFOs and, you know, weirdness that I'll find on the internet. So I figured I'd stick a UFO there. Don't know whether I should have covered that guy's face, though. Maybe I should have made the guy's face in front of the UFO. But he did have a big staff in his hand as well, which I you know, sort of you know, rendered out. And the clouds from under the UFO are put into the background over that side, looked over there above those rocks. So, yeah, I think that came out OK. Maybe I could have done it a bit better. But I do like the fact that there's like a freighter being destroyed just up here above Rockwell that you can't see right now. And then above the actual um, UFO, you can sort of see the corner of a station up in the top corner there. But anyways, that, that's pretty much my PC at the moment. So hopefully seeing the two bits of footage next to each other, hopefully i've got it tweaked and about right i'm hoping to go live this evening and continue on playing on my um save on pc because i haven't got that many hours clocked up on pc and i haven't done all of the story as yet there's still more to be done anyway hopefully this is looking a lot better until next time oh i forgot this is a cup of tea with captain steve episode look at that it's still full oh it's got all little bits on the floating on the top now maybe i left it to stew too long Oh, still good. Oh, that's a lovely copper, actually, mate. That's freaking good. Till next time, goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again. <laughs>